Intermittent fasting is one of the fastest, easiest, and healthiest ways to lose weight and improve your health. Forget the complex fad diets and click the link below for our fasting system to see results yourself. But for now, today's video. The question, can we drink glucon D while fasting? No. Fasting means not eating or drinking anything with calories. Ideally, you should be drinking only water during fasting. One of the primary purposes of fasting is to reduce insulin and blood glucose, which allows you to go into body fat burning mode. Drinking sugary drinks or fruit juice increases insulin and blood sugar and stops your fast. High insulin will turn off the body's ability to burn fat for energy leaving you feeling even more hungry and run down. If you can't manage to drink only water, try unsweetened tea or coffee with nothing else added, not even a little sugar, no artificial sweeteners, no cream, no butter or oil. If you can't manage water only for 24 hours, try starting out with a shorter 16-hour fast and work your way up to longer fasts over a few weeks. If you feel overwhelmingly hungry, you could try a cup of bulletproof coffee, with butter and MCT oil, for the first few fasting periods. Since the calories are all from fat, they will have the least impact on your insulin and blood sugar and the MCT oil is quickly converted to ketones to provide energy. This is a crutch, but still a better option than sugary drinks, since it keeps your body in fat burning mode. I found it was very helpful for my first couple of weeks trying to adjust to a 16, 8 time restricted eating schedule, but tried to wait as late in the morning as possible. After a few weeks, I could make it to lunchtime on most days without any coffee. You can try it the first few times that you do a longer fast to get you through the day, but push as long as you can without it with the goal of being able to go with only water. If you are burning fat that you eat, you are not burning as much body fat. If you are fasting over 24 hours, you will need to replenish your electrolytes. I think one common exception to water only is that some people like to mix their daily requirement for salt, potassium and magnesium into water with a little lemon or a cup of homemade bone broth. Lemon has very few calories, and you can skim the fat off the broth to keep that low calorie as well. Do not use commercial bullion or soup sands. They often have added sugar. For more answers, or a full guideline on fasting, check out the links in the description below.